In this video, you're going to learn how to create high quality SEO friendly business websites using AI without writing a single line of code. For AI, we are going to use Kimi K2 because this is probably one of the best and cheapest model out there to write code. And we are going to use Kine as an AI code editor. You can use something like Kilo Code or Roo Code because all of these AI code editors are open source and absolutely free to use. For your ease, I have created this detailed prompt as well. This prompt works best with Kimi K2 and it will help you to create high quality SEO friendly business website using Kimi K2. So this is going to be an absolutely beginner friendly guide so if you are a complete beginner and you have no idea where to start this video is for you so before we dive deep and start this tutorial please subscribe to this youtube channel and click on that like button as well all right the first step is you need to sign up on moonshot.ai to get an api key for kimi k2 so kimi k2 is an ai model released by moonshot.ai and this is probably one of the best and cheapest model out there to write code there are other ways to access kimi k2 you can access it on something like open router or on something like grok.com but the most reliable way is to access it through moonshot.ai so so just go to moonshot.ai and then click on this Kimi open platform. Simply just click on this. And now this is the dashboard of Kimi K2. From here, you can just go to the API key section. Just go to API key section, click on create API key because we are going to create an API key and then we are going to use it inside our AI code editor. So I'm just going to name it tutorial. You can just name it anything. And after that, you can just select your project. I'm going to just choose my default project. And after that, simply just click on OK. And now this is the API key that we are going to use inside our AI code editor. Just copy this API key and just save it somewhere because we are going to need that in a second. Your next step is to download VS Code. So you can simply just go to code.visualstudiocode.com. This is an IDE or in simple words, you can say it's a code editor. So it's a completely free and open source to use. You can simply just click on download for Windows and then you can just install it on your computer. So once VS Code is installed, just open it. And now you can just click on this open folder. And from here, just choose a folder, any empty folder on your computer. So I have just created this empty folder. I'm just going to click on this select folder. And now you can see our empty folder is opened in inside VS Code. The next step now is to download Klein. For that, just go to the extension section inside VS Code. So on this left side, you can see there is this extension tab. So simply just click on this extension button. And from here, you can just like look for C-L-I-N-E. So just look for Klein and you can see here is Klein. You can simply just click on that. You could either use Kilo Code as well because you can use Moonshot API key directly inside Kilo Code as well. Or you could just like use a Roo Code as well because all of these other AI code editors are basically the replicas or you can say the forks of Klein. So Klein is the main AI code editor. So we are just going to use Klein and also it's completely free and open source. There is no subscription fee. So and also it works really well with Kimi K2. So that's why we're going to use Klein. So simply just click on Klein and from here you can simply just click on install button and that will be it. Now you can just see on the left side you can find Klein in here. Now once you have done that and Klein is installed on your computer, the next step is to now set up your API key. So remember the Moonshot API key that we just created. So you can just go to your Moonshot dashboard and from here you can just like copy your Kimi K2 API key. So this is the Moonshot dashboard and just copy this API key from here and now just go back to client and from here you can just enter your api key in here and then just press on done and that's it now your api key has been configured and you are good to start using ai and start writing code so far we have just installed vs code which is our ai code editor and then after that we just installed client as well and then we set up our moonshot api key so that's what we have done so far now next step is we are going to create an empty next.js project what is the next.js project next.js is a framework that we used to develop full stack applications so because we are going to develop business websites so that's why i highly highly recommend you using next.js so what you need to do just go to nextjs.org slash docs and then just go to the installation tab from here and then from here you can just like copy this particular command which is npx create dash next dash app at latest so just copy this command from here and now just come back to your vs code project that we just like set up in here and from here you can just like click on this terminal so you can see on this bottom section there is this terminal tab in here so simply just open that terminal tab and then just press ctrl v this command that you copied from here this whole command that you copied from here just paste that command in here press enter and now next yes will be installed and the empty project will be created it will ask you to give a name so i'll just give it to me k2 biz so i just gave it a simple name i'll just now press enter and after that it will ask you some of the questions just simply press enter and just go with all of the default options which are already selected simply 
to just keep clicking on yes 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 and that's it and now it will start installing all of the dependencies and it will set up an empty project for us so right now you can see our empty project has been created and in fact you can locate all of the files in here inside this explorer section so now our empty nexus project has been created now next up is to just like start writing code and for that you can just like maybe give your own custom prompt and then ask client to like start developing your website or maybe you can just use the prompt that i provided you you can just find the link to that prompt in description so you can just like use that prompt then customize that prompt and then you can just like give it to client and then client will start creating your project so this is our prompt that works best with kimi k2 and client so you can just now customize this prompt you can just like add your business name in here you can also mention your industry slash your niche as well and also your target audience and also the primary goal of this website are you going to like use this website to, to generate leads or maybe showcase services or maybe sell products or build a brand authority also you can define your brand colors so now you just need to customize this website details section in here if you can do this manually by yourself that's great otherwise you can just copy this prompt from here and now you can just like maybe open chat gpt or gemini or maybe just like go to uh kimi k2 you can just, because you can like start using it for free so you can just like go to kimi k2 as well and now you can just like provide kimi k2 this prompt and now you can just like ask it to customize this prompt and then just share some details about your business so what i'm going to do i'm just going to ask kimi k2 please customize this prompt so i just gave it this prompt please customize this prompt for my business i want to develop a business website for my ai agents development agency my aim to create this website is lead generation and my audience is entrepreneurs and businesses who need automation so that's what i'm asking and also i mentioned please update the website details section we just need to update this particular section so now once you have explained what you want you can just like maybe add your own custom details as well maybe like any further details about your business and after that just press enter and now give me k2 will update this prompt and then create a very customized prompt for your website so now you can see kimi k2 has done a really good job and created an updated prompt for us and also it has updated this business details section as well so now our own customized prompt is ready to provide it to client so i can just like copy it from here and now i can just like go back to vs code and inside i can just like go to this client and now i can just like paste that prompt that i just copied from there just make sure that you have like moonshot selected you have provided your api key as well so once everything is confirmed and now you have just provided this prompt as well so now just press enter so now client will start using kimi k2 and start developing this website right now you can see based on our prompt client has already started planning this project and now it will start writing code as well in a minute so right now you can see client has already started working and it has just installed this framework motion package as well so now the client agent is setting up everything for this project it is customizing all of the code as well and in fact in here on this section you can just like track all of the progress as well and right now you can see client has already started writing code as well right now it is customizing this particular code file which is global.css it is making the required changings and once that's done that it will create our main page.esx file as well that will actually be our main landing page so let's just wait for client to finish writing code and then we'll test it and see how it has performed okay so now it just finished writing code it took some time i think around like five six minutes but it has finally finished writing code and now i'm running this project you can just run it from here you can just like go to powershell and now you can just write this command which is npm run dev press enter and now it will start running this project you can just like copy this link from here i'm already running it on localhost i think 303 or 3004 maybe but let me just open it you can just like open any browser add your oh okay fine cool amazing this this looks nice this this looks like fully finished website okay it got all of these different sections and in fact it added images as well it added blogs as well so they are like dedicated blogs as well and yeah it is looking good let's just see if it has created any other pages so let me just click on about okay so it has created a dedicated about page as well that has like information about your executives and some other information about your company wow cool this looks really amazing services amazing ai audits custom agents integrations perfect yep it got all of these services in here that's just mind-blowing then case study 
so it got these case studies as well blog let me just check blog so there is a blog so all of these pages are like dedicated pages so this is not like a one page website these are like dedicated pages and all of these pages have like dedicated content on it which is just mind-blowing so the contact page is here as well so it just created all of this in one go because we provided it with this prompt and kimi k2 just like took this prompt and then created this like really really nice looking website now you can maybe just like add your calendly link and ask it to integrate calendly inside here so people can directly book meetings directly from here the results are just mind-blowing for me honestly i mean this is not just like another average ai generated website this is a proper fully functional website that you'll pay maybe like i don't know a couple of thousand dollars to any agency to like build something like this with all of these different pages and the content and like proper it's a proper professional website now let's just see how much did it cost so if i just go to platform.moonshot.ai and in here if you just go to the overview section inside billing let me just reload and let's just see how much this total api call actually cost so it costed around 0.4 dollars so this entire website that it generated was just for 0.4 dollars that's just like that's insane kimi k2 with client can create high quality websites with just like one simple prompt and that too like multiple pages website and that too not like average looking website it's like a very professional website with all of the pages and all of the sections and all of that it built less than half of dollars which is just like mind-blowing now if you need to make any further changings you can just like ask client again to make any further changings or you can simply just now publish this website on something like Versal or something like Netlify. So this is Versal and this is Netlify. You can use these services to host your website absolutely for free. But to deploy your website, you need to push your code on GitHub. So this is GitHub. You can just like sign up for GitHub. There is a separate video where actually I guide you in detail in step by step that how you can push your code on github and then publish your website on versal so you can just like follow that video from description i will also share the source code of this website as well so you can just directly use this design and maybe further customize it or maybe you can just like change its content so rather than creating your website from scratch you can just like use this beautiful template so yeah, i was just like shocked by these results that this ai model produced so just go ahead give it a try and let me know in comment section what you have produced using kimi k2 i'll see you next video bye bye